When creating a new feature to improve our products, we are driven by our customers and our purpose and platform vision, which we've shaped with over 20 years of customer and industry relationships. We discover opportunities to improve by engaging with our customers on their experiences, analysing data and staying informed on compliance requirements and industry advancements. This information uncovers a lot of opportunities, so how do we decide what to build first? We consider which of these opportunities fit with our purpose and vision and to make the greatest positive impact for our customers. The most important opportunities here are usually compliance updates. Our team must address these first, so our customers can remain compliant, stay up to date with forever improving industry standards and focus on helping their patients. Once these are complete, we can move on to other opportunities. Let's select this opportunity to explore the process for building a larger feature. The first step is analysing platform data and having conversations with our customers so we can gain a deep understanding of their needs and pain points. Guided by this understanding, our teams of designers, developers and business analysts brainstorm or ideate a broad range of possible solutions. We work with our clinical advisors and directly with customers to validate and flesh out the solution until we're confident we can create the best experience. After this, we refine the solution to its simplest form, so we can deliver something useful to customers and garner early feedback as soon as possible. We then iterate and build upon the solution until it's ready for release. We do not compromise on clinical safety or customer data. So once a feature is functionally complete, we do rigorous testing to minimise risk. During this testing process, unexpected complexities are often uncovered. Although addressing these issues can be a lengthy process, it is vital for security and the user experience. Once the feature passes the testing process, we release it to our customers, sometimes in a staged process. But we don't stop there. We continue to make improvements as we learn from user behaviour and respond to feedback. This means our customers' experience gets better and better.